we started uh, slow again and we expected that honestly we are still recovering so you could see mentally also uh, the players were a little bit affected uh, because when you get tired it's not only the legs that is affected and then we had to wake up uh, at five in the morning to come here and play the, the first game because by seven we were, it was a must that we are here so i honestly believe that uh, uh, we started slow and then we freshened the team a little bit made one sub in the midfield to try and uh, up our game we got better once we introduced busiso and then we had to make another three subs at half time to freshen the team again but in all honesty, uh, I, I'm not very impressed about uh, today's uh, game. Yesterday we had a very uh, good tournament, three games where uh, everyone was happy about the game and the decisions that were taken. Today, every ball that you go out is an offside. Every touch, when you touch the opponent, it's a, it's a foul uh, uh, for the opponent. But we never got fouls in this match. The offside that we saw, the, even the people here were screaming here, they are surprised about the decision. When the coach asked, they ask on the bench, uh, the match officials, they are threatening me, but they are laughing with the, 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 the coach uh, of the opponents. They are laughing with coach Ashwin on the, on the bench here. You see, we can't have a tournament like this. A, a big tournament that has to promote uh, two teams to the uh, Matiba Championship, which is the first division of the country. They select the players for the uh, uh, national team in this tournament for the Kosafa. And then we have a, a, a shame officiating like this. We can't have a, a, a something like this. The, the game must be won in the field and it must be won by, by, by both teams. If there's a mistake, when we talk, they don't have to threaten us. It's three teams here. It's as it terms is the match officials. But the, the way they behave here is like they are police officers. They can't be threatening us. They can't. Um, coach, I'm um, sure you maybe were expecting to win on this game so you can secure your, your spot to the semi-finals. But uh, by the look of things, your team was defensive from the first minute. Uh, what was your game plan coming to this game? Were you planning to uh, secure the draw or what? Because you were not attacking much. Yeah, the game plan will be the same, my brother. We, we arrived here uh, uh, Monday in the morning. We had to play yesterday. We have to play with the same players today. You see, so the game plan is the same. As much as you want to attack, do you have the enough uh, energy to do it the, the whole 90 minutes? You see, it's very difficult to be a coach of high barrier at this moment because of uh, the travelings, the game that we played. We came here, you can't change the lineup uh, uh, that much. Fresh and one or two players. So obviously, even if you want to attack, you want to press high, it's not easy to do that when you are coaching high barrier. I wish you guys could understand uh, uh, how, how painful it is for me to look at these players that traveled the whole night to come here and play the next day and have to play again this morning. This morning, I'm saying now we, we woke up at five to come here and play this match. What time did the players sleep? So as much as we wanted to win the match, it was not easy to, to do it. The game plan was to try and win the football match. If you don't uh, win the football match, don't lose a football match. Because if you don't lose, you still stand the chance of qualifying. Coach, the, 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 the head coach of uh, the KZN said uh, was uh, has brought back the, the conversation about the tight schedule, uh, seven days to compete to for these playoffs. Do you think it's a factor or something that we'll have to live with? Yeah, honestly, uh, I heard that interview. Uh, it makes a lot of sense, my brother, considering some of the situations uh, like that involve us. If you have enough time to refresh the team, you'll get the best out of everyone, the coaches, uh, the players. See, we, we have young kids, uh, the, our right back is only 19 years. If we overload him like this, he's a promising young player, to be honest. He's a promising young player who is a player for the future. But now if you bend them young as they are, it can also affect them. But that is a discussion for the other day, but uh, it, it makes sense what he, what he said, in all honesty. Coach, given your situation, which is very, very difficult and we understand, do you believe that your team has done enough in these two games? Honestly not, uh, to be honest. I can give ourselves uh, uh, maybe 50%, to be honest, and we understand our situation. Uh, we couldn't do more than what we did uh, at this moment. Uh, but I believe, should we qualify for the semi-final with the rest from just after this game and tomorrow's rest, we should be a, a, a team that we are in the, in the, in the, in the semi-final. Thank you very much, Coach. Thank you.